हे गाइस हाय हेलो नमस्ते आदाब सत असलम वड़क कमेंट खम्बा गनी टू ऑल ऑफ यू वेलकम टू टुडेज क्लास एंड इन टुडेज क्लास गाइस वी आर डिस्कसिंग अबाउट हाउ टू बी बेस्ट इन मैथ्स राइट सो दिस इज द स्टडी टिप सेशन वेयर आई विल बी टेलिंग यू दैट इफ यू आर लाइक अफ्रेड ऑफ मैथ्स है ना वॉट आर द स्टेप्स विच यू कैन फॉलो विद द हेल्प ऑफ विच यू विल बी एबल टू लर्न दिस सब्जेक्ट ओके सो गाइज फर्स्ट थिंग फर्स्ट लेट टू टेल यू दिस थिंग लाइक the best thing about maths if i tell you is it's a very scoring subject and also once you start understanding it is very difficult like to forget it yes you heard me right for those students who are afraid of maths for them it will be like you know sir you're lying but if any of your friend loves maths just ask him that what is the easiest subject he feels and he'll be like ki maths and if you ask him why because he'll be saying ki we don't need to study much about it once you understand you'll remember the concept throughout that's what the best thing about maths is it's all based on concepts there is not much ratta over the formulas if you'll see formulas are also very less okay and once you practice those formulas also you'll start remembering okay you'll remember each and everything because that's what maths is all about <laughs> okay so it's a very good subject guys hai na and it is very easy to develop the interest in that uh, so for all those students who are still afraid of it let's start from the very basic first thing first whenever you will be studying any chapter note down all the first go through the whole theory note down all the important points all the formulas all the theorems all right make a note of it make your own notes do not go for internet and download the notes no make your own notes and so when you write it you'll remember it you'll 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 understand it all right and make short notes okay second thing is understand the concepts see what the teacher has told if 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 suppose if you don't have access to suppose the teacher has already taught that in school you have plenty of videos explaining on internet our whole channel i have taught each and every chapter from grade 9th and grade 10th you can go for any of those videos right learn the concept from there and then practice those questions on your own so understand the concepts then start by solving examples whatever video you have watched in that the examples which have been solved once you have seen the solution after that solve those questions again if you remember for all the videos in the description box i gave the link to download the pdf as well you can download the pdf and uh, you have the questions now solve it on your own right so that also you can do so once you start by those solving those examples solve the examples given in your book then start solving ncrt's questions hai na next thing is if you are getting any doubt get it cleared with the help of a teacher with the help of your friend no matter what it is but get your doubts cleared on whenever you are studying it get it cleared as soon as possible first priority is to go for the doubts all right do not keep your doubts do not be afraid ki if i ask this they might they think i i don't know this it might be silly sometimes in maths it is actually i'm telling you in maths whatever is sometimes a, a small little thing also na will makes us confusing ki yaar why how this is happening and later you'll get to know ki oh it was quite easy so it's not a big thing in maths there are like many of the time students will ask very small doubts but it's very like it's in a good way okay if you are asking a doubts you are getting it cleared it it would be like ki you understood it you will like ki, oh it was a small doubt it was a easy silly doubt now you only will understand that right and uh, suppose if there is a good doubt as well you will also get to know that how that question particular question will be solved so take guidance as well please don't be afraid what others will be thinking like go to your best friend or if your father or mom can help you go there your elder siblings internet anywhere get your doubts resolved that's the first thing okay once you have got your doubts resolved practice 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 makes the man perfect and in maths practice is everything all right so practice for all the questions which you have done uh, during revision also suppose when you are studying a topic some questions you found it difficult mark them all right so that when you do the revision you'll get to know that these were the questions which you found difficult in the first reading and you'll be sure to go through those questions one more time you'll be revising them one more time you'll be solving them one more time so in that way your revision also is going to be quick and don't lose touch with the basics please understand this thing maths is all about basics and it is all connected whatever you have learned in grade 8 will be used in grade 9th 10th 11th 12th what you will study in grade 9 will be used in upcoming grades right 
so it's all about the basic concepts which you are learning and that is why understanding is important uh, rot learning ratta is not going to help you over here understanding the concept is the thing which will sail you through the mathematics so guys please remember understand the concepts rather than ratta okay so understand the concepts and you'll be able to touch uh, keep in touch with the basics as well all right so note down all the important points make notes of your own understand the concepts don't do ratta you know? uh, if requires take the help from internet as well internet say hello yeah you have this thing okay take help uh, solve examples all right uh, get your doubts cleared don't put your doubts on wait get your doubts cleared as soon as possible practice 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 makes a student good in maths all right and don't uh, lose the touch with the basics all right so these are the tips and also guys in vedantu's app you can now uh, go for play mode in which you will be able to attend the quizzes and we have gamified the learning right so just earn uh, the complete the daily challenges complete the live challenges and uh, uh, go to the higher levels earn more points and those points you can use to get rewards you can be in the leaderboard as well there will be daily leaderboard weekly leaderboard monthly leaderboards you'll be able to see your rank complete daily challenges hai na uh, and these are like a learning games so related to your syllabus you can learn you can take it in the form of a quiz and learn from it as well so that's a very good thing guys do download the vidantus app and definitely complete this and you are getting the rewards for it as well okay guys and also one more thing you can register for vedantus pro subscription for uh, for your help with your studies any point you can definitely go for it and to get the uh, financial backup gp pro is your code because you'll be getting a uh, discount with this all right gp pro all right bachcha so this is all from my side thank you so much guys for joining the session and i'll see you all in the next class till then bye bye sayonara khuda hafiz to all of you guys bye bye